And we are back once again, folks. This is week 13, my NCAA 14 football dynasty. As you can already see, it's the Kentucky Wildcats versus the number one ranked Georgia Bulldogs. Of course, I'm running as the Bulldogs. Let's go on ahead and get into it. Kickoff is uh, kind of mediocre. I'll take it out. Even though I did want Hemp Hill to take it out, but battle kind of got in the way and wouldn't move. So that's how it is. There he is. Man of the hour, right there. <laughs> Ty Gurley. This dude's been handling business. See if we can get this guy going early. I'm already calling his number early. Hand off left tackle. Oh, make the first guy miss. Oh, <laughs> let's go, baby. The first play from scrimmage. The first play of the game. Tug, let's go. Give me that seven. Easy money. If it's going to be like that, man, this dude's going to have career day today for sure. Seven nothing Bulldogs. Got the kickoff going. See if our defense can come out and match that same intensity as our O. Or as Ty Gurley. <laughs> Oh, they come out spreading the field. Come out in the shotgun. Okay. First completion for 15 yards to the wide out. Oh, I see what they like to do. They like to run that no huddle nonsense that I hate. Okay. This might be interesting, folks. Stay tuned. As they hand off to the back up the middle, play gets shut down. I mean, it gains a couple yards, three or four yards, but whatever. I hate that no huddle nonsense, man. Okay. Killing me with that. Teams have been getting getting at me with that all season. Second and six with the sack. So that puts them back. Every yard the running back gained on the prior play just got taken back off the sack. So we'll take it. Coming out spreading the field for a while with the back. Probably back there to check. Oh no, they release him out in the flat. And he's open. Damn it. And I saw it too. Yeah, a little late with the reaction. It's all good, though. The quarterback is two for two on this drive. Yeah, they better run that no huddle. First and ten, the quarterback drops back. Throws it out of bounds. This dude had time, too. He could have taken some more time to look downfield. I'm sure there was a guy running open somewhere, but whatever. I'm not complaining. <laughs> whatever, dude. Let's go. Bringing up a second and ten. Again, spreading the field with four wide. Boom. Good hit. Good hit from the safety. I mean, they pick up six, but, you know, whatever. Spreading the field again. Looks like a three, four wide. Oh, nice little screenplay. Goes nowhere. Bringing up a fourth and two. Let's go. Good shot, defense. Oh, they're going for it. Okay, these bombs want to. I'm going to pull their the balls out match. early. Okay, I see. Got to call a timeout since you guys want to run. Oh, then they come out and... Sp oh, come on. Typical. I call a timeout because I'm in a 4-6. I'm not matched up properly. Then they come out and they spread the field on me. All right, all right. I love the little head game chess match by the uh, opposing coach. Gets it out quickly. Nice little pass play for six yards. Brings up a second and four. Third quarter's winding down. Got about 35 seconds to go. Burning all my timeouts, though. They come out in the shotgun. Spreading the field yet again. Drive back. Give me that. Oh, come on. Where's my pick? That should have been picked. It should have been my ball. I'm not sure why they didn't give it to me, though. Whatever. Chalk it up to the CPU. So they can come right back and hit the slant play in the zone. All right. I, I see what you're trying to do. Trying to make things interesting. Bringing up a first and 10. 24 seconds to go. Making all kinds of adjustments at the line. QB drops back and just throws it out of bounds. Why? The guy was wide open. QB back there panicking. This guy is seeing ghosts or something. This is nonsense. So we get a second and 10. Gives the ball to the back, tries to run up the middle. Nope. Only gains a couple yards. Get off me. Get off me. <laughs> Why is he sitting there laying on me? I love that infinity engine. Ooh, with the sack. Junior Powers. 
goes down with the sack. So keeping them at, uh, at an attempt for three at least. Hopefully they miss it. Uh, and they make it. Damn it. All right, so there goes my shutout. Really didn't expect to get one anyway, but I'd rather give up three than seven. So they're kicking off. Battle's taking it at the one. Ooh, damn, just knocked out about the 24, 25 yard line. See if I can get something going on my second drive. Even though Gurley just took care of the whole first drive with just one handoff. Let's see if he does it the second time. Uh, breaks the tackle. Oh, finds a hole. He has space. Oh, stay on your feet, baby. Stay up. Stay up. Oh, he almost busted that one too. Gained 20 though. If he would have just stayed up one, just two, too many two and a half seconds. He would have been running. He would have been running for a touchdown right now as I'm speaking. Jeez. All right, so get that. So it brings up a second and five. Making some pre-play checks. QB drops back. Hits Gurley out the backfield. Runs the man over. Oh, my gosh. I feel sorry for that linebacker. Wrong place, wrong time, playboy. Brings up a third and two. Jukes. Ah, oh, comes up short. So it brings up a fourth and inches situation. And those who have watched my video already know what I'm doing here. I'm already at the 50-yard line. I don't care. Down in distance. Let's go. Boom. Let's go. So we got a first and 10 after the six yard conversion off the fourth and inches play. We'll take that. Let's keep it rolling. Got to keep this momentum going. Nice little draw play to grip. Oh, draw play to the halfback. Gets blown up in the backfield. Lost a two. Okay, I'll give you credit. Good D, good D. Brings up a second and 12 situation. Still running the ball through Gurley though. Actually, you know what? Let's switch things up. Make it interesting. Oh, come on, man. My tight end. That's on me, though. I kind of let him right into the defender, so that's on me. Whatever. You still should have caught the ball, damn it. <laughs> Bringing up a third and 12. 43 seconds left to go in the second quarter. QB drops back. Oh, hits the tight end. There we go, baby. Nice conversion. We gotta hurry it up, though. We only got 38 seconds to go, so let's get to the line. Let's run a play. Hand off to Gurley. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have ran that, but whatever, man. My my offense just runs through through the halfback, Hemfield slash Gurley. So you already know. Got to give him as many touches as possible. Oh, way to thread the needle, baby. Let's go. We're in the tight window. First and goal situation. Oh, Gurley just walks in. Nice play. Easy money. Let's go. Just ring it up. That's 14-3. 13 seconds to go in the kickoff here. Nope, they're not bringing that out. So all we got to do is pretty much just stay in front of our guy. We can actually back off a little bit. Play some sort of prevent. But you know me, man. I like running man straight up. In the occasional zone too, but primarily man. First and ten. Ball on the 36 yard line. So we come out. Matching up. See if they get aggressive and try to throw it. Oh, give me that. How is that not a fumble? Somebody explain to me how that is not a fumble. I don't understand. Six seconds to go for halftime. They come out in the shotgun. Boom. Oh, give me that. Give me that. Okay, so the first play that should have been a fumble wasn't, but the second play was definitely a fumble, so let's go. And I'll just take three points here. Not exactly a chip shot, though. That was a good 45-yard, 46-yard uh, field goal, actually. So we'll take it. Going into the half, 17-3. Looks like we're on cruise control. So since I got the kickoff in the beginning of the game, I got to kick it off second half, so they get it. Let's see what they do. See if they get some momentum going. Hopefully not, though. Our defense has been pretty stout. The quarterback drops back, looks deep. Oh, the hell was he throwing it to? Actually, if I was in better position, I probably could have picked that. But whatever. Bringing up a second and ten off the incompletion. They hand the ball off. I never really understood that. Why hand the ball off in the pistol or even in the shotgun for that matter? You're handing the ball off to the back so deep in the backfield. I don't understand why you want to do that. 
Doesn't that give the D a uh, somewhat unfair advantage? I mean, I guess if one guy penetrates the gap or whatever and you're handing the ball off in the backfield, you can get that play blown up and easily be negative, what, six plus yards. I don't know. I guess that's not that's that's why I don't play uh that's why I don't play football. That's why I never played. That's why I never was an offensive coordinator. Never aimed to be a coach of any level. The only coaching I do is right here on video games, on NCAA and, and on Madden. Just certain certain things are just mind boggling. Kind of getting sidetracked here. Ooh, nice catch by the tight end. Look at the touch pass by the QB though. He kind of threw that up in the in the area of the, the coverage, but Q, uh, the tight end went up and made a nice play. Hand the ball off to Gur Gurley up the middle. Boom, here we go. Is he hurt? Oh, come on, baby. Get up. Shake it off. Come on, is he out there? Let me see. Oh, dude. You better not be hurt, man. Nice completion for a touchdown to Trey Jones, the wide out. I mean, I could throw all day. That's easy, but I like I like running the ball through uh through my back. Come on, man. We'll see if he makes it back out in the next series. Hopefully it's nothing major. Score is 24 to 3. A minute 38 to go in the third quarter. Okay, so it's just a dislocated dislocated thumb or whatever. He'll be back soon. Nothing major. This offense has to get rolling. They come out ah, when they hit the back, man. I mean, the tight end. Jeez. All right, so we got a first and 10. And then put those wide receivers in one on one opportunities against the defense. And you blitz, you're really leaving yourself vulnerable. Little play action. QB tries to keep the ball and run up the middle, ends up losing a yard. It's not happening. Not happening, folks. Bringing up a second and 11. Oh, that's trying to do the Peyton Manning thing back there. All right. Takes the ball, jumps back. How does he not get sackled right there? Sackled. <laughs> How does he not get sacked back there? <laughs> this dude, like, stepped up in the pocket and avoided the sack. But the defender was right on him. Little nifty move to avoid the sack right there. Bringing up a third and 17. Drops way back. Tries to run a screenplay. Oh, damn. Missed the tackle. But he's still not going anywhere. So it brings up a 4th and 12 situation. I highly doubt they'll go for it. Nope. Going ahead and give me that back. Kraft back to receive the punt and runs right into his own man. That's garbage. Lamar Kraft. So let's see what we do here. We got a 1st and 10. 9 seconds to go in the 3rd quarter. Nice little pitch to Gurley. Follows the blocker. Nice block. And he has daylight. Oh, makes the guy miss. Oh, stay up, baby. Ah. Nice little 31 yard rush on the pickup. You know, I think I'm thinking this might be his best game of the season. This dude has been damn near unstoppable this entire ball game. Just under three to go As we wrap up the third quarter in the fourth quarter with a nice little handoff to Gurley off the left side. There he is. Good little six yard pickup. We'll take it. Keep the chains moving. Once again. Oh, nice little juke move. Gurley's getting it done, man. <laughs> 12 yards on the pickup. Let's go, baby. Please excuse me if you guys hear the helicopters flying overhead. I do live sort of near an airport, but what can I do? They decided to fly over as I'm doing commentary. Garbage. But anyway, like, like I'm saying, as you can see, Gurley is just killing it out here. AKA Hempfield. Nice little handoff. Look at the hole. It's like Moses is part of the Red Sea. This guy's just running up the running up the middle of the freaking lane. Like nobody's even there. Alright, so that brings up first and goal. You already know what I'm doing here, man. Gurley's been the workhorse all day. And there he is. Easy money. Count it. Let's go. Should be 31-3. Hopefully we make the field goal, and we do. So we're now at uh, about two minutes, a little bit over, about two minutes and four seconds to be exact. As Kentucky takes the field, they're in desperation mode, so I'm hopefully trying to pull off a pick or something right here. Ah, give me that. 
Once again, how is that not a fumble? I don't understand. I didn't see any freaking arm motion. That's not the freaking tuck rule, Tom Brady. Just under two minutes in the game. They come back. There it is. Oh, give me that. Give me that right there. That was my pick six to end the game. To just put the boats high on the present. Just walk out. Freaking drop the mic and walk off stage. Damn. All right. But anyway, brings up a fourth and 19. My defense is swarming right now. They're closing the ball game out for me. We got a minute and 30. About a minute 30 after the punt. Kraft back to take it. And runs right into a pile of people. So we got a minute 26 to work with. I should just come out here and just pound the rock and just get out of here. This Hemfield runs off left tackle and there's nowhere to go. So we get stuffed in the backfield. Actually, he was tackling the line of scrimmage. So we didn't lose any yardage. Just lost a carry, but whatever. Still second to 10. Same play. Opposite side. Oh, nice stiff arm. Just threw dude down. Like, get off me. Get off me. <laughs> This guy is a beast out here. So we got 47 seconds. Gurley takes the snap, runs right in the middle. There's nowhere to go, but he still manages to gain four yards. Just going ahead and just let this clock run down and get out of here. Next play, Gurley off left tackle. Oh, runs the man over again, and he's off to the races. Makes the guy miss, but can't. Oh, he gets tripped up. Stay up, baby. <laughs> this guy is unbelievable, man. 19 rushes for 257 yards and three touchdowns on the day. That's unbelievable. It's about to be four. Give me that. Let's go. Let's go. I see why this guy is all hype right now, man. This guy is killing it. So, a lot of you guys might be thinking, why didn't you just take a knee? I mean, what the hell for it, man? It's a video game. I'm just out here having fun. I could have just taken a knee and just gotten the game over with, but that's on them. They have enough time to maybe run maybe two plays max. Oh, they're going to run the ball. Yeah. So this is pretty much it right here, folks. Eight seconds to go. As soon as they line up under center, the clock should start going. Four, three, handoff to the back up the middle. Yep. So that's my time, folks. want to thank you for tuning in. This was week 13, Georgia versus Kentucky and that's a wrap another win in the books BCS title hopes we're still on the line baby we're still we're still taking care of business so thank you for tuning in thank you for liking and subscribing for all my new subscribers out there and current subscribers I love you guys all the same I got a um, little sweepstakes going so go on ahead and check out the video for my subscriber giveaway go on ahead and answer that as always Thank you for viewing. I appreciate everything. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out of here. And I'll see you in the next video. Here, and I'll see you in the next video.